Welcome back, this is Yamajack. That was an embarrassment. What you've seen in the background there. We don't talk about it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try that again. <laughs> uh, what happened was a, a quarter pound spawned, enraged, hit a scrake, which enraged it, and then it charged me, and uh, then I got like a horde of raging flesh pounds and scrakes all coming at me at the same time. And, uh, wasn't, wasn't good. So you might notice in the background there is a different music in the, uh, in the background now. Um, we are playing Dejit X. I just discovered him today. Really like his music. Um, so I've been using him for all the videos that I've recorded today. Of which, this is the first that will actually get uploaded because... Ugh. I've recorded, uh, I recorded the... God. Just hit him. I recorded the, uh... Oh, I'm also moving my microphone over a little bit and changed the gain on it a little, so my voice might sound a little bit different as well. Don't worry about it. Um, hoping it sounds better. Uh, it does sound better, actually. I checked it because I've already recorded some videos today. Um, <laughs> uh, what sucks is my performance in this one is so much worse than the last one, too. Except for we're not going to die to a scrape. You might die to the boss, but not the straight. Um, <laughs> anyway, the uh, the Z time weekly I recorded, but that's such a boring weekly. It was like a 17 minute video. I'm like just just one match, 17 minutes, one four round match, 17 minutes. I mean that's just an insane amount of time to spend on one match to me. Most of my videos are you know 12, 13 minutes long. Maybe a little bit longer if I go off on a tangent, but like the match was 17 minutes long just because it took so long to reload and I just kept complaining throughout the whole thing. So I'm like, this isn't a good video. We're not uploading it. Then I tried to report some online matches as a, as a medic, but like, nobody respects the medic. Um, so you don't have anybody, you know, protecting the medic in the, uh, in the earlier waves because all I have is a pistol. And you don't have anybody feeding the medic, so it lasts even longer that all I have is a pistol. And then once I get a weapon, they're like, oh, well, you, you've got a weapon, you don't need help. I'm like, no, I still need help, because I'm still not really focusing on the Zeds, but focusing on keeping people alive. And then everybody abandons you, and they're running off on their own, and I'm like, y'all just stay here. And uh, then everybody dies, and it gets overwhelmed, and it sucks. Um, anyway... That's what I've been doing today. So, I'm uh, I'm back. I'm doing some solo runs. We will do online soon. I promise. I'm not sure if we'll be doing Hell on Earth, but we might do Suicidal. I'm not sure. I want to do online because uh, I like it. It's a lot more difficult. Um, but it's just it, it's it's a uh, a whole thing. I don't really want to fight a bunch of flesh pounds. Why do they get to spawn in rage? Like, who decided that spawning flesh pounds in rage was fun? I'm going nowhere. Who decided that? Who made that? Can I speak to the person who made that decision? Because I would like to complain. Because that's not a good decision. I'm playing a lot of Kakiri Forest off camera as well. It's uh, becoming one of my favorite maps for um, gameplay purposes. The uh, Steam Fortress is still my favorite map just in general because it is beautiful. But uh, for gameplay purposes, this is uh, definitely one of my favorites because of this little spot right here where everything kind of comes at you from the one side. I know that there are maps that are built to do that, to capitalize on this kind of uh, gameplay. But, I don't know. This one is just the one that I found, and uh, it feels good to me. So, we, uh, we do it. And I don't have to, you know? Like, when the boss wave comes, I don't have to be fighting it here, you know? Like, I can move to somewhere that might be a little bit easier to, uh, to fight the boss. Which is uh, just nice to me, because in, the, in a lot of those other ones, you know, you can't run off somewhere you you have your lane and you defend it <laughs> and when the boss comes you kill the boss 
Uh, and I'm not quite good enough to like take down the matriarch without being able to run and hide somewhere, you know? I'm barely good enough to take down the matriarch at all. Who is this mysterious marksman? On hell on earth, anyway. Oh, I love this weapon. I just discovered it in the last run we did. Such a fun weapon. You gotta not be there. Yeet! Where are we headed? Uh, that's the uh, the store where you get the, the deco shield. The deco shield. The, however you pronounce it. Yeah, I'm hoping that the microphone position and the gain on it will have less peaking. I don't know. It may or may not. You know, we'll see how it uh, how it goes. But I'm hoping that this position is a little bit better. It's probably going to take some uh, post processing for me to get the balance all set up before I'm able to actually like just get it. Found some ammo. Um, so I'm probably gonna have to do that. That's gonna be a little bit tedious, but. I think I've got it to a point where it's, it's pretty good, so I'm not still oh, on. Rock and roll. I was like one frame off on the skip. Back to it, mes amis. One frame. Got some ammo Come here. on. Give me that pistol ammo. Just don't get enraged. Actually, do get enraged. Thank you. We love both of these. I don't want to get shot by you. Your bad game design. I really like this weapon, the AK-12. It's fun. Mighty uh, strong, while still being not it, like for for the price and like when you can get it, it's honestly like really you good. I uh, I've really played with it too much. I always go for the um, the stoner like immediately or uh, scar or like the uh, MKB12. I think it is. I don't normally go for the AK-12, but this is actually like a, uh, a really good weapon. I'm um, happy with it. With the performance of it, anyway. You're out, mate. It's mighty fine. Headshot? No, I can't. So you got. I didn't know. I can't tell with when it's uh during set time if that was the enraged sound or not. I don't think it was, but he is enraged now for sure. Oh, that's that's the wrong weapon. Please, 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 no! Literally died in the same place. Do almost the same thing. Oh. Man, that stinks. Okay, well, I'm not... I'm not mad about that one. That one was on me. That wasn't... That one was on me. I did that. I can accept that. Oop, I'm sorry. I smacked my, uh... A pop filter. Uh, we're gonna be doing another run then. Uh, what do we want to do on? Let's go for evacuation point. Hostile ground. Infernal realm. I don't like the creepy maps. Is the thing. Nightmare, nuked, 
go for let's do let's do, let's do another outpost run. I am gonna I'm gonna switch to uh, to SWAT. I really want to get it to 25. We're almost we're almost there. We're getting there. I, I do want to start with these guys on. We'll switch over in a moment here. I'm hoping that the audio sounds good because I am like so much farther away from the microphone. It's incredible. Um, so I'm going to be a lot quieter. I'm talking a lot louder to compensate for that, but I'm hoping that because of the... Uh, where did they go? They just disappeared. I just saw like a bunch of Zeds that just disappeared. I don't have like a camp zone here though. Mysterious marksman. Pop. Oh, I thought I was gonna hit his head. I was confident in that one actually. Bang on. Oh, crap. She shoots, she kills. Can't wait until I have the uh Z time perk for this guy. Because uh infinite ammo during uh Z time. It's like the uh the Chris or the um Or the, uh, the nail gun. That sounds just extremely good. many of these guys there are because there's a lot of them that's like what three four that i've seen so far it's a lot of these uh these raider dudes that's what they're called right the raiders i think that's what they're called right sounds rightish to me Ooh, that one felt good. I ordered a. Uh, what's it called? Perfect. Some jars on Amazon the other day. Let's get you restocked. And uh, an abandoned. And. They did not lay a claw on you. Bench scraper with the. Uh, I forget what it's called, but it's the thing that holds a razor for like slicing dough. So I want to get into sourdough making. I wanted to get into sourdough making for quite some time now, actually. Uh, I'm going to want to switch these guys over. Oh, boy. Uh, give me my nail gun, please, and fill that right up. <laughs> um, I don't know when I skipped trader voted, but <laughs> could have been really bad. Um, so I want to get into sourdough making for a while. And the jars are here, but... The banditon isn't, and I'm like, do I really want to make sourdough without the banditon? Like, I don't know. So you don't like that's what you use to shape it, is, is my understanding. So without it, like, well, I could shape the dough without the banditon and just kind of not have perfectly shaped, you know, ribbed dough. But then again, it's like it should just be here soon. So I'm like, well, it also takes like. You know, a week at least to get sourdough starters. So maybe I should start it now, and then by the time I have a starter, like the stuff should probably be here anyway, right? So I'm kind of torn up about what I should do with my uh, with regards to my sourdough starter, because part of me wants to just make it, but I have it. And I mean, worst case scenario, okay, I'm not making bread, but I make pancakes or, or something that doesn't require shaping or scarring. End that X -factor I'm not sure. I am excited. Goodness gracious. I'm excited to get into uh, some Tower Ghost Starter stuff because that's, that's something that I've wanted to do. I love bread making. And uh, right now with uh, all the stuff going on, it's kind of hard to get heat. Um... So I'm like, well, you know, as good a time as any to just start culturing my own. 
I also want to get into like making jam. I wanted to make uh, dandelion jelly for a while. It's like the time of the year now for, for making dandelion stuff. Oh no, don't tell me I'm gonna die. No, I think we're good. We have a lot of dandelions outside, but it's like we also have a septic tank outside. And you know, you would you would hope that uh, it's not leaking. But I mean can you can you really be a hundred percent confident that there's no contamination? Eh, not really. So I'm like, I don't really want to eat that stuff. Killing a scrag is never easy, but you did it well. Oh no, we don't need that. We don't need we're good, we're good, we're fine. So it's coming from the bandits and it's coming from Hong Kong, I think, so I'm like I don't know. Hoping it's here soon, because right I really, really want it. Right I also ordered, uh, uh what, what else am I waiting on? Oh, whetstone, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm waiting on a whetstone to come as well, because I want to sharpen my knives. I was, uh, I was trying to make meatballs out of uh, some pork chops that I had the other day, and I don't have a meat grinder, so I was like, well, you know, I've seen people chop up, you know, meat pretty finely with, uh, where is the cloaker? I heard cloaker. Somebody called out a cloaker, but I don't. I don't see it. Um, yeah, you know, I've seen people chop it up pretty fine with knives before, so I'll just chop up my pork chop nice and fine with the with the chef's knife and call it a day. You know. Well, <laughs> turns out you need a, a mighty sharp knife. Where? You need a mighty sharp knife to be able to do that. And. Uh, my knives are not, you know, record-breakingly sharp, so not really something that is very viable in the end. No, that didn't make it. So we're gonna go for some first here. Try and just take them out as quick as we can. It's been a few days since I played Killing Floor 2, so. Uh, Bear with me as I uh, kind of get used to stuff again. Oh boy. Uh, we're dead. Okay, so this was a uh, disaster of an episode. <laughs> but it's going up. That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Uh, if you liked the video, hit the like button. Subscribe if you want to stick around. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.